in the story, we got a gingerbread man and he comes alive and he runs away. Hi everybody, I'm Sarah and this is George. George and Harriet. George and Harriet and today we are going to make stained glass biscuits. Are you ready? Yes. We are a bit excited about these because they look really tasty. First things first, we need to make the biscuit dough. So what is this? Um, yep. This is butter. Oh, sorry George. And then we're going to add, what's this? Sugar. This is sugar. And we're going to mix this together. We're going to add our egg now. Ready? going to put a couple of drops of vanilla. Oh, that smells nice, doesn't it? And then we'll add our flour. Do you want to pour it in? Okay, George, I think you might need to get your hands involved. Why? Because look, it, it's all going to start to come together like a dough. Oh, yeah. So when it starts to look like this, you need to get your hands in. Are you ready? We turn it out so we can yeah. mix it into a dough together. Can I do it? Yeah. Hold on. So you can stop and put the spoon down now, Georgie. We've got to squeeze it together like this. What we're going to do next, when it's all together in a dough, we're going to wrap it up in some cling film and then we're going to put it in the fridge to chill for a little while. Can we pat it down? You can pat it if you want to. So here's our finished biscuit dough. We're going to wrap it up and pop it in the fridge to chill and then we're going to come back and roll it out. So we have got our dough out of the fridge and we have rolled it out and we're going to use some cutters. Shall I show you what to do first? Even, Hang on. Down on the dough. I know, but we've got to make a secret hole in the middle. I'll show you. Ready? So we're going to push our cutters down. With so we have got one. Christmas trees. Oh, yeah. And one's a little bit smaller than the other. So we've cut one Christmas can tree I out. Do, and then we're going to. this big one? Yeah, hold on a sec. We're going to cut a secret one out in the middle. Look. This is why these biscuits are so special. So we're left with a hole in the middle. You ready? And then we need to put that on here. And what do you think we need to put in the middle? <gasps> a boiled sweet. So if you choose one to put in the middle. So we're going to carry on making our biscuits now. You just need to pop a... Sweetie, sweetie. Pop a sweetie, that's right, in the middle of each of the gaps you make. If you make smaller gaps in the middle, you can crush these up as well and then just sprinkle them into each little hole that you've made. I'm going to pop them in the oven now. So here are our finished stained glass biscuits. If you wanted, you could thread ribbon through some of the holes and hang them on your Christmas tree, couldn't you? If you'd like to make your own stained glass biscuits, you can find the recipe at goodtoknow.co.uk. Thanks for watching and happy Christmas. Bye. Bye. Happy Christmas. Bye. Bye. Happy Christmas. Goodbye.